Hello, this is Bob Cook here. I'm doing a short presentation on how to work with the child ego state, which I presented before um, various places. I've done a very short video here, just talking about what I think may be some of the uh, most important parts of it. Okay, the major methods to work with the child ego state, that means to get to the past script decisions and look at how uh, the connections between the past and the present have been lost and uh, specifically looking at how the child ego state is the historical um, ego state when looking at um, fixated stuff, deficits and uh, how the person sabotages themselves being in adult, that means in the here and now. Okay, the major uh, methods I use uh, when actually helping uh, clients get into the child ego state or in other words how to facilitate the whole process um, so we can get to the child ego state. Uh, first of all I contract for that so um, I talk about what the purpose of going to their child is about and um, uh, talk more about how they sabotage themselves and what they want for the future at that point. But the major three ways that I use come from Erskine's ideas Nerskin's methodology from integrative psychotherapy. I mean, he was a transaction analyst, um, developed the whole methods uh, of how to work with the child. So his three methods are inquiry, attunement and involvement. Uh, inquiry is asking questions in an open way, um, utilising your curiosity, uh, being specific, but make sure the questions are open and not closed. Open means exploring, um, not closing down, not demanding a yes or no answer, but actually exploring gently with the client through their different developmental ages. Attunement means that you're attuned to the client in a rhythmic way, with their pacing, with their rhythm, and also developmentally attuned to their particular age that they might have regressed to or moved to, Specifically, of course, if they're moving for child ego state. And of course, you need to be involved, you need to be actually <coughs> uh, with the client. Of course, if you're attuned to the client, then you will be involved by definition. Okay, so the major three methodologies of getting to the child ego state is inquiry, attunement, and involvement, according to Richard Erskine. Okay, so now let's move to how come you're going to the child ego state. So you're looking for the script core decisions that make up the whole life plan or the mini script for the, um, the person. You're looking particularly for how the past, present enactments are created and how they enact their child ego state, their unconscious, in a way that's not useful for them in the present day. In other words, sabotaging their chance to... Um, uh, be healthy in terms of decisions uh, and not stuck in some child unhelpful way of looking at the world. Um, of course, by uh, <coughs> asking and inviting them into their child ego state, you're helping them increase awareness of different parts of themselves and how they might be stuck in the past rather than the present. You're helping them make new decisions, new redecisions to let go of the old sabotages, and finally to help them anchor in the present the new decisions and what's most important here that you're helping them actually be able to stay an adult and to utilize their child and adult and parent ego states in the service of integration okay hope that was useful to you and uh, speak to you soon bye bye